search for burp suit on google and you will see the first link so just click on community edition after clicking on it uh, you will be landed to this page go and click on this go straight to downloads so here you will get the option or uh, choose the uh, machine type that you are using so in my case mac os intel so i'll click on download so sometimes uh, download uh, doesn't start automatically so in that case what you can do uh, just click on uh, try downloading again link So once you will click on this, uh, you will land it on this page and then click again on download button. So it will start downloading that uh, setup file. So once the download uh, will be completed, you just need to open this file and uh, rest will be uh, pretty much simple. Uh, okay, uh, so now I'll double click on it. So it is uh, installing. So installation is done. So once the installation is done, just drag this uh, icon to the application folder. So in my case, I already had uh, installed this Bob suit. So it was asking me to replace it or create a new one. So I replaced it. So I'll start the Bob suit community edition. So once you will start this, you will it will ask you for permission if you are using Mac. Okay and just uncheck this you can i accept so this is the window default window you will get every time you when you start this bobsuit community edition so in community edition you will get only this uh, temporary project uh, option so click on next and then you will have to choose uh, the default uh, bobsuit if if you have some uh, configuration file already available then you can choose the used configuration file so this is a dashboard page uh, of Bob suit so we are not going to cover anything here so we I'm going to show you how you can set up this proxy so that it will start listening uh, whatever your browser is interacting with this server so in my case 880 port is already occupied by some other uh, service so I need to uh, change the port so that uh, Bob will start listening via that port so i will make it to 882 click on ok and then uh, make this uh, intercept uh, uh, toggle on okay now i'm going to launch the uh, uh, chrome browser via binary file so and also i'm use, going to use the user directory as a temporary folder to make uh, this session uh, new one from the existing session so the reason is uh, if I'll use uh, current session then all the networks will intercept by uh, this pop tool and which I don't want so that's why I'll create a new session using uh, the new temporary folder now I'm searching for this website uh, localhost 880 uh, for instance so it will start intercepting uh, the request and response here so as you can see uh, it is working okay. so as you can see uh, so whatever page I will navigate from this uh, session browser uh, all the information will be captured by this proxy and here you can see the, uh, the all the URLs the request and response which are communicated from this browser to the server so this is a history uh, you can go through and this is the intercept tab where you can see the current request and re response which are intercepted uh, I think this is it uh, this is how you can install and set up a uh, verb 